The latest technological breakthroughs from China are arriving at a pace the world can barely keep up with. From the deepest mountains to the busiest factories, each development feels like a leap into the future. These are not distant visions but real systems now shaping daily life. Machines that think, tunnels that cut mountains in half, and laboratories that probe the universe itself. And before we dive deeper, make sure you subscribe and click the notification bell so you never miss updates on the boldest shifts in technology. China reached a milestone that stunned global physicists. The Jiangmen Underground Neutrino Observatory in Guangdong filled 20,000 tons of liquid scintillator and powered up, beginning official data collection. Resting 700 meters underground, this facility is now the largest and most precise neutrino experiment on the planet. Early results already outperform design limits, proving its ability to probe mysteries that once seemed untouchable. At the heart of its mission lies the hunt for neutrino mass ordering, a puzzle in particle physics. But its reach extends further, capturing signals from the sun, earth, supernovae, and even cosmic rays. With this, a fresh doorway to the universe has been forced open, one that confirms how the latest technological breakthroughs carry us closer to answering questions once reserved for philosophy. Hidden deep in the rugged Tian Shan Mountains, a massive passage is being carved by human determination. The Tian Shan Shengli Tunnel in Xinjiang stretches an astonishing 22.1 kilometers, making it the world's longest highway tunnel under construction. Crews rely on the meeting halfway excavation approach, supported by a design of three tunnels and four shafts. Two hard rock tunnel boring giants, Shengli TBM and Tianshan TBM, are tunneling from north and south. When complete, this link will slash the journey between Urumqi and Korla from seven hours to barely three. The expressway will stitch together the isolated regions of northern and southern Xinjiang. More than civil engineering, this project represents how China's latest breakthroughs in infrastructure rewrite time and distance with sheer precision. It also brings new opportunities for trade, tourism, and cultural exchange across the region. By reducing travel barriers, it will open isolated areas to faster development and modern connectivity. The tunnel is also expected to ease freight movement lowering transportation costs for industries. Its construction demonstrates how large-scale engineering can reshape both geography and economy. The Tian Shan Shengli Tunnel is not only a passage through mountains but also a symbol of determination to link people, resources, and opportunities. China's railways are famous for speed, yet maintenance has often been the hidden struggle. That is changing. In Jiangxi province, smart rail robots are now patrolling high-speed tracks during the heavy summer travel rush. These machines scan entire systems in just 15 minutes, a task that once consumed hours. They can operate in zones filled with electromagnetic interference where humans often falter. With robotic arms that mimic natural movement and advanced perception sensors, they can diagnose faults instantly. A technician can trigger a full emergency repair with nothing more than a phone command, and the fix can be done in under two minutes. This shift in rail safety shows how the latest technological breakthroughs in robotics are not limited to factories. They are embedded in the daily arteries of national life. During the V-Day Parade in Beijing, 
Attention was drawn not just to soldiers marching but to towering machines scanning the sky. China revealed its newest domestically built radar systems, emphasizing both power and readiness. These mobile radars can identify stealth aircraft, track ballistic missiles, and adapt rapidly to changing conditions. Their dragon scale designs are striking, but function matters more. Instant folding and deployment across terrain from highways to railways to rugged battle zones. Operators describe them as independent eyes in the sky with unmatched adaptability. Two never-before-seen radar types were displayed, shaped by evolving air threats and real combat requirements. On a bright Monday morning, Shanghai's Agibot stepped into history by launching its first mass-produced lineup of humanoid robots. The series includes interactive service robots, quadruped robots, and dexterous omni-hands, products priced from tens of thousands to hundreds of thousands of yuan. The flagship Agibot A2 even completed a continuous 24-hour city walk to prove its navigation stability. Beyond performance tests, the industrial version A2W has already been deployed in Sichuan factories, hauling thousands of boxes daily. Nearly 100 additional units are already contracted, worth millions of dollars. For the first time, Shanghai has shown that humanoid robots are not simply prototypes but commercial goods. The rollout is a powerful sign that the latest technological breakthroughs in robotics are breaking free from research halls and becoming part of everyday industries. Once seen as science fiction, humanoid robotics has become one of the fastest-growing industries in China. These machines, shaped to mirror human appearance and motion, are no longer bound to laboratories. They now stand on production lines, taking on repetitive tasks with precision and endurance. Their impact goes beyond efficiency. By cutting labor costs and speeding manufacturing, they reshape how factories function. More importantly, their design allows them to blend into environments built for people, unlike older industrial robots. In every sense, these advances represent China's latest breakthroughs in automation. They reveal how the latest technological breakthroughs can humanize machines while transforming industries from the ground up. Companies are racing to refine their intelligence and adaptability, pushing them closer to true collaboration with humans. Researchers envision a future where humanoid robots assist in healthcare, education, and household tasks. Such versatility makes them more than factory tools. They are companions in progress. With each step forward, the line between human skill and robotic ability grows thinner. At the World Smart Industry Expo in Chongqing, visitors witnessed something historic, China's first artificial intelligence computing open architecture. Alongside this launch came thousands of new products, from smart robots to connected vehicles and digital cities. More than 600 companies joined the event, showcasing the direction of industry. The open architecture challenges the old model where companies worked in isolation. Instead, it encourages shared standards, shared resources, and collective growth. 
A joint laboratory under the National Advanced Computing Industry Innovation Center will oversee its expansion. Artificial intelligence demands vast computing power, and China is answering with facilities that look more like futuristic cities than data centers. In Guangling County, a newly opened park has become the nation's largest hub for research and integration of computing equipment. Forecasts from industry experts suggest a growth of more than 40% in national computing power this year alone. These centers are designed for speed, efficiency, and enormous processing capability, feeding the needs of everything from AI models to national infrastructure systems. Their construction shows how the latest technological breakthroughs in AI are not only about algorithms but also about the physical muscle needed to run them. China is building that muscle at a scale unmatched anywhere else. The 2025 World Artificial Intelligence Conference in Shanghai turned heads with a single spectacle. More than 60 humanoid robots moving, talking, and working. From factory floor efficiency to frontline customer service, their versatility was on full display. This was not a science fair but a business showcase, proving that large-scale commercialization is now within reach. Engineers and entrepreneurs alike saw firsthand how far the technology has matured. For many, the conference signaled a turning point, where the latest technological breakthroughs in humanoid robotics are about to leave the experimental stage and flood real markets.